Hi, I wanted to remind you how to get your finished scratch project embedded into a blog. Uh, sorry, embedded into your Weebly blog. Um, so if I play this, you can see that it draws my word. Of course, your word or phrase is longer because you did eight characters. And I have the music in. And so this is now ready to go on my Weebly blog. To do that, I have to go to my project page. I have to make sure that I've made this public, which I think I have. Um, let's see. I'm going to go to this embed block. It must be public because I don't think I have the embed block. I mean, I think if it's not public, you don't have the embed block. So I'm going to copy this whole thing. Um, and then I go to my Weebly blog and I create a new post. And I'll write my scratch drawing. And then I'll scroll down here to find the embed code element. And I will click here. And I like to have mine in the center. Sometimes you have to click more than once. So there's my scratch. Oops, that's the wrong one. That's my video from before. So I'm just going to erase that whole thing. And I'll put embed code back. And I will go back here and recopy. Whoops. And I just closed my Weebly. So we'll wait a minute. Sorry about that. Go to Scratch Projects. Go to my draft. And try pasting this code. This is the right one, I can tell. OK, so now I've centered it. And now my Scratch Project's there. And you will need to put a text block down because you will have to write about this. So make sure you check Moodle to see what you should write about. And then don't forget to publish live. And even though you may not, probably don't have to, it's also a good idea just to publish, just to make sure everything's updated. Now if I look at that, and I go to Scratch Projects, there is my drawing. And it will so impress your friends and parents. Okay, thanks for listening. Ciao.